Hello my love. Welcome to my update gossip channel. I hope you are well. Can you please do me a big favor? Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Robin obeys Cody to survive today and is Mary Brown leaving the Sister Wives financial pool. Sister Wives star Robin Brown didn't have it very good before meeting Cody Brown and joining his family, as fans witnessed during the first season of the TLC series. For her very first meeting with the Brown clan, she had to borrow the money for gas to make the four-hour road trip to their house. Now Cody's adult daughter reports that Robin does what Cody says, unlike the other three wives. But she does this for her and her kids' survival. Robin Brown didn't have much of anything when Cody Brown courted her all those years ago. In the book that all five sister wives adults penned several years back, she gave an example of how tight money was. Robin was invited to meet the other wives by Cody and Mary Brown. These two had been hanging out with her, so Mary already knew Robin. But the other two wives and Cody's 12 kids hadn't met her yet. So, she had to borrow the gas money to make that visit which, was a few hours away by car. So she was broke. But then she met Cody, who told her about the Sister Wives reality show they had in the works. Robin said at first, she thought this was wishful thinking for Cody Brown. But it wasn't and by marrying into the family, she became part of the show. Plus she got all the perks that come along with the fame, like money. Cody Brown had said on the Sister Wives camera that he wants his wives to obey him. He was tired and on a long road trip when he said it. He had his four wives and all the kids jammed into an RV that probably was made to sleep six. By this time he had a lot of kids, Mary had one, and both Janelle Brown and Christine Brown had six each. So, when Robin brought her three kids from a previous marriage into the family with her, this added up to 16 children. Then, the last two were born to Cody and Robin not long after this. The sister wives patriarch became overly stressed and started to bark orders during this road trip. He wasn't too savvy with RV life. So, much to the pleasure of the fans, when it came time to empty the sewage, it spilled all over him. With that said, to describe him as stressed well, that's an understatement. He said he wished that he could just bark orders, and they would obey him. Then he used this mounting stress as an excuse for his choice of words. But he said it and as you can see in the video tweeted video above, his wives took offense to this, all except for Robin that is. Gwendolyn Brown doesn't want to trash Robin, but she says that Robin does what Cody Brown tells her to do, so he favors her. But in Gwen's opinion, she does this for her and her kids to survive. Since Robin once knew what it was like not to have money, maybe she fears ever having to go back to that way of life again. Gwen also said that Cody buys into this obedience thing. That's why he constantly defends Robin on and off sister wives. Gwen suggests that she's the only one of his wives that follows his orders. Even when Cody made that remark. This season about sacred loneliness, three of his sister wives brides rolled their eyes. They called it stupid and dumb. But not Robin, she agreed by saying, plural marriage gets lonely. But to her, Cody's term of sacred loneliness gives her time to get closer to God. So, from what Gwen Brown had to say about Robin, her tendency to follow the leader is just a matter of making sure she's in a place that provides for her and her kids. As drama unfolds in the 18th season of TLC's Sister Wives, Mary Brown is attracting attention with her decision to move to Utah. Last week, she hinted at a revelation that could throw Robin Brown and possibly Cody Brown into turmoil. The move is more than just a relocation, it seems to be a statement about where Mary stands within the Sister Wives family. Could this move mark the beginning of the end of Mary's financial contributions to the collective pot? Mary often cites moving her business to Utah as the main reason for the shift. She plans to base her operations on the BNB she owns there. This is interesting because the sister wives family has always had a common financial system. They combine their income into what fans affectionately call the sister wives cookie jar. Money from this pot is then allocated based on the family's various needs. And as viewers know, it's not just about sharing expenses, it's about supporting the family structure they've built over the years. So when Mary talks about moving her business, it inevitably raises questions about her ongoing contributions to the shared family pot. Viewers of the show will recall Janelle Brown noting that Robin often received more than her fair share from the family finances. Even with Christine Brown out of the picture and Janelle considering leaving, it is plausible to think that their contributions to the common pot are dwindling. 
This has led fans to speculate whether Mary Brown's upcoming move means she is the next to stop contributing to the joint funds. While she is still trying to work out her relationship with Cody, it does raise the question, will Mary's income still find its way back into the family coffers? Cody Brown has been at the center of several controversies regarding the family's finances. One of the family's children, Gwendolyn Brown, has previously shed light on how Cody and Robin seem to be living beyond their means. Mary's move, therefore raises questions about how this will affect Cody's financial stability. Now we must consider this within the context of Mary and Cody's fractured relationship. Mary has made it clear that she does not want Cody to misunderstand her move as a withdrawal from their marriage. Still, the financial aspect could be an unintended but crucial factor in how Cody perceives the whole situation. The episode airing next week was recorded before the couple officially broke up. But could this move be the straw that breaks the camel's back? If Cody is already stressed about finances, and with two women likely taking their finances out of the joint family account, Mary's relocation could be interpreted as financial distancing. Despite the complexities, fans of the show can't help but feel that. Mary is genuinely concerned about how her actions will affect Cody, emotionally and financially. While it seems like Cody has already moved on emotionally from Mary, in terms of finances, it's a completely different story. Fan forums are buzzing with theories. Some believe Mary's main concern may be that she contributes to Cody's financial stress. After all, her move comes at a time when multiple sources, including family members, suggest that Cody's financial management is in question. So, could Mary's move to Utah inadvertently increase Cody's financial stress? Even if Mary has no intention of changing the financial status quo, Cody could interpret her move as the beginning of the end of their shared finances. Mary's upcoming conversation with Cody could well be the turning point not only for their relationship but also for the financial stability of the entire sister-wives family. What do you think about this video please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video.